Hmm, is it just me or does something seem a little different around here? Hi, I'm Joe, content coordinator for the Purdue Well, and I'm here with a really special message. We have a new site. <laughs> One of our goals for the past year or so has been to make the OWL site more accessible and useful. However, we wanted to do this in a way that didn't diminish anything we already had. So if you visit our new URL, owl.purdue.edu, you'll see a brand new style, but you'll also see that all of our content and organization is the same. We've still got the navigation menu and the section links to help you get around. If you're on a desktop, you can find these things to the left of the page's content, over here, and above the page's content, up here, respectively. Note the search link, too, is this little magnifying glass above my head. However, one of the nice things about the new site is that you don't need a desktop for it to look sharp. If you use a tablet or a smartphone to visit our site, you'll notice right away that the page's content automatically adjusts to fit your screen. For example, on my cell phone here, the navigation menu moves to the bottom so that all of the page's content is in a single column I can scroll through. This is something we couldn't do with the old site, where you'd have to kind of zoom in and zoom out on a phone. And since we know a lot of our site's visitors aren't always on desktops, we're really excited to start offering our content in this new form that everyone can access. Another reason we updated the site is that we wanted it to reflect our new focus on video content. You'll see that there's a collapsible Purdue Owl vidcast link over here. Right now, this set of pages mostly links to our YouTube channel, but we're planning to build this part of the site, so check back soon. This new video effort doesn't mean that we're trying to shift away from our traditional text content, though. This year, we're planning on adding a ton of new written stuff. For example, one long-term goal is to add a section that helps grad students with professional documents for the job market. We also want to explore the possibility of writing content for middle schoolers. In both cases, our goal is to make our content relevant and accessible to the broadest possible audience. We know that we have many different kinds of users who come to us from many different classroom contexts, and we'd like to start reflecting that better than we do. I should also say that, as always, we'll be keeping our popular citation resources up to date and accurate. Note that uh, we have these new quick access links for MLA, APA, and Chicago over here, by the way. So to sum up, the one thing all these changes have in common is you. Our users are our main concern, and they always will be. So please don't hesitate to get in contact with any feedback you have about the new site. The forms are here, under contact, and they look like this. Thanks for watching, and thanks for visiting. We're looking forward to having a good school year with you. Till next time.